Are you serious? Are you serious? There on the left of the screen, you can see the explosive solar flare erupting from the sun. Now, yesterday we talked about the one million mile uh, uh, solar uh, filament that was on the sun that is still on the sun with this huge, I mean, huge, you knew there's uh, sunspots underneath that filament. There's no question. Well, Last night, I think just before midnight, uh, there was an, a massive eruption, a uh, solar flare eruption, magnetic field of a sunspot, AR2282, uh, does not appear to be very unstable, but proof came on February 9th, which was last night, just before midnight, when a sunspot magnetic canopy unexpectedly erupted producing an M2 class solar flare. According to NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory recorded the blast. Now, according to Suspicious Observer, the uh, good information is this. It was not facing the Earth. It was not facing the Earth. And actually, this solar flare, even though it erupted, uh, the CMEs the uh, are not headed toward Earth nor any other planet, for that matter. It's just going to go into the space uh, uh, out into the cosmos. So there's good news there. Bad news is this. This isn't where the one, where the million mile solar filament is. This is an unexpected eruption, which proves it is unstable. And so what we have here is a situation developing where the sun is truly going to be very volatile in this solar cycle. We're going to continue to keep an eye on it. Uh, the CMEs uh, will be could easily create uh, an explosive amount of ultraviolet rays, uh, of course. And there's other you know concerns I have is. If this kind of eruption or others start frequently hitting the Earth, the tectonic plates, and we've seen that, that earthquakes will have an uptick. So again, there was a major solar flare. It was an M2 class. It came out of uh, just before midnight last night on February 9, 2015. But good news is it was not Earth-facing. So we'll continue to monitor what's going on. The Bible says there will be signs in the sun and in the moon, and in the stars, and distress of nations with perplexity.